do 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 I do 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 I hope you like it hot because today we're making buffalo wings. We're starting off by making the blue cheese sauce, which is a must have side dish for the buffalo wings. It takes four ounces crumbled blue cheese, two thirds cup buttermilk, one cup creme fraiche, one cup mayonnaise, one teaspoon Worcestershire sauce, half a teaspoon sugar, half a teaspoon garlic powder, half a teaspoon mustard powder, a pinch of salt and half a teaspoon black pepper. Next up we're preparing the wings. We're going to cut them in half, add one tablespoon of vegetable oil and a third cup flour. Dust off the wings and place them over an indirect heat on your barbecue set at 180 degrees Celsius or 350 degrees Fahrenheit. Smoke the wings until they have reached a temperature of 75 degrees Celsius or 170 degrees Fahrenheit. Make sure to give them a flip halfway. When the wings are done, it's time to make the hot sauce. We're starting off with two tablespoons butter, half a teaspoon cayenne pepper, half a teaspoon garlic powder, half a teaspoon salt, and we're going to add that to a hot pan. When the butter has melted, we're adding half a tablespoon Worcestershire sauce, one tablespoon Tabasco sauce, and six tablespoons of Frank's Red Hot sauce. Now that all the ingredients are done, it's time to mix them together. Look at that screaming hot color. This is going to be good. But if you serve it with celery sticks and the blue cheese sauce, man, this is definitely good eating. Well, the wings turned out looking good and uh, they got a nice crisp from the oil and the flour. So uh, that did a great job and Frank's hot sauce, it really killed it for me together with the butter. A traditional recipe and perfect for the barbecue. I hope you guys enjoyed the video. See you guys next week.